I won't have to commentate if they can't see me. <laughs> hey guys, we'll go back to Let's Play Super Mario Galaxy 2, and guess what we're doing in this episode? We are heading... Actually, you know what? Screw it, let's do this stick bitch! I didn't give a crap! I was like, you know, let's go fight Baby Bowser or whatever. But no, I'm gonna do this stick star Because And in fact, I don't even know where this is one stinking is. So I'm gonna have to keep an eye out, I suppose. Yeah, so let's see if we can actually do this. Hmm. I don't exactly recall where this uh, little secret star is, but I'm sure I'm heck gonna try. I just ran straight into the thing. That's not good. But we're actually gonna keep an eye out and see if we can't find this secret star. Now, something's telling me that he's actually inside here, but let's actually find out. I'm actually doing this totally blind, because it's totally just like, whatever, I don't give a crud. Let's see where this little guy is. Okay, okay. As long as we're here, hmm. Let's follow the star bits. Will you really be in this 2D space, though? I'm not too sure on that. So on second thought, let's just actually <laughs> get through this part. I actually got hit again. There's one on my eyes. Just, that's just Peachy. That's Peachy Kane. It's Peachy Kane. It wasn't, wasn't that like Miss Miss Peachy? What was that? There's some, somebody in a cartoon named that. I know that for a fact. But oh well. It's not really that important. And wow, we took a whole crap of a lot of damage from just that little thing. It actually wasn't that little at all. Now, uh, corn, corn's good, tastes good, you know, something tastes good, I almost guarantee that this guy's somewhere around here, let's see where he is, the trick is we gotta find this little punk, also we gotta get this bob -omb over here, well he just died so maybe not, hmm, well he's definitely not over here so come on Mr. bob -omb. hurry up, don't die, don't die, he just fell off, that's sticking annoying. That's stinking uncool, Mr. Babam. Mr. Babam, please don't fall off. You gotta finish the level, Mr. Babam. Mr. Babam. Mr. Babam. Run into the thing, okay. And I'll detonate, revealing <gasps> the innards of this disgusting level. It's full of tar and also some kind of poop. Let's spin out of here and let's see where we, if we can't find this little guy. He has to be on here. Where else could he be? Hmm. It's kind of hard to say, but you know what? I'm gonna try and look for this little guy. Where you at, man? Man, where you at, dog? Dog, where you at? No. <laughs> so, let's try and figure this out, man. Let's try and figure this out. We need the Baban to actually explode over here. Well, pretty much just get open up his path. Come on. Oh, good. Good, good. Did I fall off? No, I'm good. All right, so that's pretty good. Let's see if we can't find that little gizmo guy. There he is. Hey, man. What's up? How you doing? Let me, let me talk to you. Hey, you. Yeah. Okay, I want to talk to you. Well, stop jumping. Oh, gosh. All right. So let's talk to talk to the guy. Hey, you're searching for that star, right? I found one of them things in a garbage dump. But hold on, there ain't no such thing as a free lunch. Hmm. Okay, you know I love those red guys. Could you give me one here? Okay, well, as as the mission, we gotta find a red gun. Now, how are we gonna do this? That is that is quite the question. Oh, is this a red guy? No, do not fall off the sticking thing. Ugh, can you kill these? Can you kill them? Can, can, can you die? Can you die? I guess that works. Spin. Spin. Ah! Yes, okay. The spin prevails. The spin is good. We love the spin. Pick up this bomb. Chuck it over there, I guess. Now we need to find a red top guy. Where are the red top guys? Oh, one's right there. Okay, buddy. Uh, just follow me, please. That'd be pretty cool. <laughs> okay. So come on. Okay, so we need to not make the bomb uh, explode near him. We just need to keep luring him to his other other demise. Come on, dude. Come on. Come on. Dude. Dude, I know you want to come over here. Dude. Sally from accounting said that you were cute. And you know what? Yeah, you should totally come over here. He just died. Oh, actually, he didn't. Is this guy invincible? Well, that actually makes it a little bit easier. Let's actually spin over here. Um, can the top guy follow us? Sure hope so. Come on. Dude, dude, bro. Bro. I know you want to come over here, dude. Awesome. Come on, just a little bit more. Come on. Top dude, come over here. And yes, we actually did that, which was actually a tiny bit difficult. And hey, he gets exactly what he wants. Ah, oh, so cute. Thanks. <laughs> hmm. Red work. Take this star for your awesome job. Well, that mission actually turned out to be a little bit more difficult than I thought it'd be. But we did it. So, eat my turds. Ha. <laughs> Stupid top people and tops. Pointed heads.
Now that secret star is completed, let's say we do some of these ones. Like the one in Slip Slide. Or Slip Sand, I don't say you know what the crap is called. Let's actually take care of this prankster comment, and well, let's actually... I kind of want to do the level that involves us getting the grand star in this episode, but I don't know if we're going to have exactly enough time, so I guess I'm going to try and hustle so we can get that done. So let's do the daredevil run for the squizzard. Ugh. You remember, this is the boss that's the sand guy. So honestly, shouldn't it be too much of a problem as long as I don't touch the enemy. So, I don't know. I'm going in. I'm going into this pretty confident, but at the same time, man, this guy's giving me some problem in, in the past, bro. So I know how this is gonna go down. Wow, it's coming out of the sand, and he's ticked. Oh man! <laughs> Actually, is he ticked? I don't, I don't know. He kind of has a vacant expression on his face. <laughs> so all we gotta do is dodge the balls that he throws and wait for him to open his mouth, like so, and just keep launching fireballs into his mouth. And yeah, that's uh, one one hit on him, so that's pretty good. I actually want to get a refill. Actually, I'm getting these balls out of here. Yeah, these balls. Balls. Stay balls now. Oh, stay coming all over the place. Like you're staying stupid. And here. Oh gosh, I'm a little too close to him. Uh, 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 let's get out of here. Okay. No, dang it. I missed my chance. Curses. You and these stupid balls. Oh, I can actually break those? Oh, there's certain ones I couldn't break. Oh, I didn't. Okay, so I'm getting a refill. And we need to step onto the land. Okay, good. All you gotta do is just make sure you throw the fireballs in just now. The only way you can beat the guy. I'm actually gonna try and take care of some of these balls. Nope. Gonna do in the cutscene. And wow, there's a lot of crap on the stinking stage, that's for sure. Okay, so now this section, all we gotta do is attack the fire hydrant things. Ah, oh, but I missed. Crap. Okay. So come on, no, let me hit the fire hydrants. Dodge the bombs. And wait, can I throw stuff in his mouth now? Yeah, I can, but I just can't get hit. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, we beat him, alright. So it turns out, yeah, I don't actually have to kill those little mortar things. They're just kind of there to make hitting him in his third phase a little bit harder. So today I learned how to beat the squizzard even faster. The squizzard wizard. I'm so funny, because I'm from 2011. That's a uh, joke from one of my other older LPs. Yeah, that's not very funny at all. Then again, are any of my jokes from any of my LPs funny? The answer is no. But anywho, we're going to Shiver Burn Galaxy. To do admittedly a very difficult secret star. Actually, it's not a secret star, it's a prankster comment. My terminology has been completely awful this LP. <laughs> the Octo Army Icy Rainbow Romp. Which is exactly what it sounds like. We're going to have to use the Rainbow Star to kill all these Octoroks. Yeah. It's not gonna be that fun. Now, so there's a time limit. So essentially, I'm starting to realize a lot of Super Mario Galaxy 2 stars are just basically mini games. Not necessarily a bad thing, it's just, I don't know, so many games are funner than others. And funner is not a weird end here, we're stinking, we're, we're skating, we're skating, we're doing figure eights, we're just dominating the icy course. Mm. Doing, just doing a jump, because I can. The problem with this one is, if you run out of stars, you're kind of screwed. So I'm going to actually make sure to well, use them correctly. I'm gonna take out all the uh, little guys I can on one side. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much the level. I'm gonna have to not fall off the map, though, because that'd be pretty stinking stupid. And, okay, let's pick up some Star Bits. Now, where's the last Octorok? There he is. And wow, we did that one without too much of a hassle, either. I'm actually. I'm not even practicing these. This is actually kind of stupid how easy these are getting. The difficulty spike in this game, I swear, is much, much larger. At least I remember it being much larger. Anywho, we got no star. And now that almost all obstacles are out of our way, let's come out aside and see. Yep, we got a pretty much every single prankster comet that we can do for right now. So let's say that we actually stop procrastinating and stink and do this next galaxy, which I don't really I don't really know how many stars it requires, but I almost guarantee that we have more than we need. And Starship Mario can advance finally to Bowser Jr.'s Boom Bucker. Or Boom Bunker. It's not Swash Buckler. I don't know, I'm thinking of pirates recently and sticking Doom Boomsday Machine. Oh no! From the sounds of it, this is Baby Bowser's final confrontation with our friend Mario. Whoa, that menacing machine looks menacing. But you know what? We can do it. And you know why? Hey, it's kind of cool. Just thinking. I never even noticed that. That's the remnants of the. I've played this level so many times. You gotta be kidding me. Anywho, so what I'm saying is this is like Bowser Jr.'s 
last robot, but it's like a part of the level. That's pretty stinking cool. I almost feel really stupid for not noticing that. Anywho, first thing we gotta do, we gotta open up this little path. Now shoot us over here now. We need to get this right, because I want the one-up. Steady, Carl, steady. Not all the way over here. No, no, okay, steady, steady. I think the shot was lined up perfectly, and indeed it was. We get a one up. <laughs> Not necessarily the most important thing you need to do in this level, but I like doing it. That's what's most important. I'm having fun. <laughs> and here there's some boomerang bros, which is the largest form of hammer bros in this game. Which, well, we took care of them rather easily, so it should really show how difficult the actual enemies in this game are. The answer is not very hard at all. Checkpoint. Now it's time to do one of those these uh. These cannons, man. I'm so bad. <laughs> I've already been out of school for a month and I've already forgotten everything. It's pretty sad. And here we're gonna launch ourselves to this thing. Hopefully get another one up. Oh yeah, I'm so cool. <laughs> now you probably see the prankster or not the prankster comment, the common metal. It's all the way over here. Now I wanna get this. Hmm. What's the best way to do this? Definitely not that way. Whoa! I guess that way wasn't too bad after all. You could just do backflips here. I guess that's more efficient. Alright, so we got the prankster comet. Prankster metal, gosh dang it, I don't know what the crap it's called. Who do you expect me to be? I'm just some idiot making videos. I'm not an English major. Anyhow. You'll use the cloud. Wow, that sun's stinking huge, holy crud. And yeah, that's basically the level. It gets actually a lot harder when you have to do the prankster comment for here, but oh my gosh. It's Baby Bowser Jr.'s. Or ba Bowser Jr. Phil. It's Phil's Tower of Doom! Oh! My dad's gonna get angry if I let you get another grand star. Huh? Time to break out my boom stay machine. I just relax in my comfy carpet and watch it go boom. <laughs> I'm not amused by your despicable, despicable forms of intimidation. I will conquer you, baby Bowser Jr. And I will make you wish you were Anywho, uh, this is how you do this level. You just come up here, get a cloud suit, shoot another cloud, you shoot another cloud, and then when you're right on top of them, just do one of those butt slam thingies. Yeah, it's pretty easy actually. Then he's gonna absorb all the clouds in the area, which isn't really too big of a deal, because then you can just do this, and it's not really that hard. Because you can just come over to this one, get another cloud suit. Uh, how about that, Quap? You're already doing the same thing again. Not really that difficult. Oh, wait, he's gonna do this, so that's actually a problem. Yeah, second thought do not ground pound when he's all electrified, and simply ground pound him when he's not. And yeah, he's almost already dead. But then he's gonna make his little fortress thing just that much taller and also mobile, so you know, it's actually kind of a pain. Don't get run over and simply rinse and repeat. Now, if I remember correctly, yep, he's gonna do that. So we're just gonna come over to this one. Come up and. Get up there as quickly as you can. Oh no, he's doing this. No. Oh no. Gosh dang it. <laughs> I was kind of hoping he wouldn't do that, but he did. How unfortunate. All right. So that just tells me we need to do this quicker this time. And also avoid those... I don't know what the crap they are. They look stinking weird though. <laughs> Flip up here and get the second tier of clouds. Which is uh, not like... Cra oh crap. Did I really just miss that? Phil Collins. Man, this boss is a lot harder than I stinking thought. Jeez. <laughs> okay. At least this is the last phase, so let's try this again from the top. And actually, the top, just do it over again. I know what I mean. That's what's most important. And here, come on. I just need these flowers up here. Okay, now that hopefully he will actually pull us in this time. Doesn't look like he will. Okay, that's fine with me. Let's jump to this one. Flip up. And if I can time this properly. Come on in. Yeah. That's all you gotta do to beat. Bowser Jr. for the final time. We sure. Oh man, he just exploded! He is surely dead. But it is honestly for the better. <laughs> As we got another cells, another grand star, and we've defeated another world of Super Mario Galaxy. Wow, can't believe. Uh, this game's really just flying by. Once you, once you start getting the prankster comments, you really just get stars like back to back. It's kind of. It's kind of cool. And yeah, we got ourselves another grand star. Time to give that back to Luma and open up. The final world's passage. Yeah, there's six worlds in this game. Yeah, for the time being. <laughs> I need to stop hinting at the after game, though, and just let it happen naturally. Like bowels! <laughs>
I swear I can't go two episodes without making a poop joke. <laughs> but then again, would it be a Johnny Awesome episode if I did not? And yeah, we got 35 star medals. Um, pretty sure we have one for every single galaxy that we've been to, so that's pretty good. That's the fifth grand star. I have a feeling you can do it. Next up is the sixth world, and you know that Bowser monster's gotta be on with something good. So let's go get more power stars. The big fight awaits. The helm is yours, Captain. How do you know this is the final world? I didn't even reveal that to the audience yet. Oh wait, I kind of did. <laughs> and yes, World 5 is just on the brink. The brink? No, it's right near us. How would you say that? I don't know, who gives a crap? This is an English class, who gives a duck? This is dunking class, and man, look at all these stinking portals. That's stinking crazy. There's a lot of crap going on here. Look at the background. The battle draws near. Do your best. Well, let's get them this time. Well, you sound like Kermit all of a sudden, Tubba. Anywho, guys, that's going to just about do it for this episode of Let's Play Super Mario Galaxy 2. And in the next episode, we try our hand at these new worlds and see how difficult they truly are. Thank so, you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you then.